Hey guys, welcome back to FNR Sports. And um, I hope you guys enjoy these videos. I'm going to put a bit more of this up. So this is me training up for an, uh, my second MMA fight that will be coming up uh, March next year. I broke my hand on the first fight, uh, which was two weeks ago now, um, since I've released this video. And uh, now I'm just trying to keep myself fit and active and so I can get back into my second fight uh, next year and um, hopefully we can impress the doctors so uh, this is me just doing my cardio day and I'll be running along uh, envelope to, towards Cape along the, um, the back roads there um, the ocean views and things like that so I hope you guys enjoy but uh, this is all just me documenting documenting history really making history so uh, enjoy and come and uh, join us in the journey well, we're gonna start getting some ocean views which will be great it might just make us run that 10% harder. Woo. Yeah, there's not a, much of a shoulder on this road. So do my best to just hug it. Some people will look after you while they're driving and some just like, they don't care, give you a horn, tell you to get off the road and you're like, you know, I'm just trying to get in a different experience. It's nice to run on the road sometimes, especially if they don't have footpath. Run to the confidence of your own abilities. So if you're, if you're confident not running towards traffic, then do it. If you want to see the traffic, then do it. It's whatever works for you. I just feel comfortable when I'm not when I'm not seeing it coming. So when you're running on a the road, there's not much uh, shoulder. Normally the corners are the most dangerous uh, or bends. You gotta be extra careful on the bends. But um, try and wear something real bright where you're visible, can be seen. Um, sometimes that helps. <laughs> but here we go, the sort of the climb begins. I don't know if the GoPro can give it a bit of justice, but um, yeah, here's the climb. I don't know if you guys can see that bit of water view and it should uh, should get better along the way so I'm not quite happy with myself at the moment uh, that's why I guess I'll take the GoPro um, as you can hear me running while I'm breathing 
I'm actually breathing way too much through my mouth. Um, um, yeah, I'm inhaling, exhaling through the mouth. Uh, when I'm really, I really need to concentrate on um, inhaling and exhaling through the nose, um, then taking big gulps of breath. Uh, as you probably, you guys can hear me, and uh, I guess that's a good thing that I've, I've, I can pick that up while I'm using the GoPro and something I can improve on. So here's this hill. It's a gradual climb. Look at the view. Woo. Oh yeah. Let's go, baby. Let's turn them four-wheel drives on and uh, climb it. Doesn't matter how we climb it, we just got to get to the top. Oh yeah. Let's go. Bounce up there like Kangaroo Jack. Woo! We're nearly to the top. Yeah, Rocky Balboa. Woo! Ah! Oh yeah. Look at that. What a view. Woo! Let's go. We're getting up there. It's taking a bit of time. We're getting up there. Woo! Yeah! Yeah! We made it up. Once we get around this corner, the view should come back. Hey. Yeah. Ooh. We got some cars nearly just brushing us. It doesn't matter, I don't see it coming. <laughs> We're just putting one foot in front of the other and pumping their arms. There you go. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah. Wow. Million dollar for you, eh? And I live down this part of the world. How incredible. I can't wait till they uh, put a trail. They reckon they're planning to put a rail trail. So when I ride my bike, I'm one of them guys on the Lycras. Coming along here, you're having to hug the road. And when there's a couple of you, you got to really watch out for each other because especially on the weekends, you know, you get people flying through. And it's not necessarily locals, it's more like holiday makers or people just coming down for the weekend. If they got sporty cars, you know, what a great road for them to test it out on. And um, sometimes you can be caught amongst the fire. <laughs> so, just look out for each other. Look at the view. Woo. So I don't know if you can see Eagle Nest. There she is. And uh, you turn on your left here. And that will take you to the nest. And it's beautiful. Got some nice car parks down there. Um, Beautiful spot to see the, the ocean, see Mother Nature in its best form. And then just all along here, there's all these hidden gems that uh, you can stop, stop out, have a look. And uh, sometimes when the main beaches, main beaches are so packed, you come down here and you can find yourself a nice spot. But I guess now a lot of people know about it and um, sometimes you can't even get a car park 
<laughs> so just pick your days and hopefully you find yourself a car park Whew. it's just the two of us just the two of us me and yeah just the two of us we could make it if we try just the two of us yeah Woo. I'll tell you what the heat is bearable I can handle the heat the wind it's a nice factor to it sort of gives you a nice oh it feels good when you sit on yeah when it hits you but it hits you too hard and it slows you down a bit but it's a nice change Woo. oh yeah we're grinding through this when in a woman there's the dimes Woo. hold on what he's got it needs Woo. yeah baby let's get a bit of these classic songs happening make sure you take a headphone or whatever because uh, a lot of the time that gets you through when a man loves a woman hey Woo. all right we got a bit of downhill coming up but um it's such a dangerous corner real sharp bend i'll just have to be a bit quick because um a lot of the times the cars come flying down and uh they don't realize how sharp this bend is and uh sort of have to hit the brakes and turn pretty sharply so we'll uh just keep our ears out a little bit and um we'll pick up the pace as we go down that hill turn on all four-wheel drive and let's get it let's get around that corner without any incidents today that'll be great all right here we go Woo. Look at the legs turn, baby! Whoa! <laughs> yeah! Whoa! <laughs> yeah! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Let's get around this bend! Come on! Keep it turning! All right a bit better now yeah, we're going back uphill Woo. yeah look at it such a crazy bend all right guys we're gonna gonna stop here at shack bay have a look it's one of my favorite places to be and sometimes it can be a hidden gem uh, sometimes it's so packed you can't get a car park we're gonna go to the look here as you see yeah baby shack bay so we're gonna do a couple of little detours enjoy the run That's what I'm all about. Oh, look at that. Only two cars down here. Or one van and that one's left. Let's go down here. 
and let's see if we can get a nice view Oh, look at that! Ooh. All right, this is the the lookout out at Shack Bay. There's some people down there, but uh, it's like the the plants are really starting to take over. It used to be like um, used to get a really good view, but yeah, you, know, you gotta allow gotta allow Mother Nature to do what she does best. But you still got a view. If you can, stand up on this. Don't fall down because it's a bit of a hill down there. And um, look at that. What a view. Beautiful. Ah, it's a nice beach. Bring the family down. You can sit. Yeah, look at that. Have a swim. It's beautiful. Yeah. Oh, well. So that's our first detour. Oh. <laughs> There's our shadow. Woo. Well, we're coming back up to Eagle's Nest. It's just around this corner. And uh, we'll stop there, have a look at the view, and then we'll keep going. All right, let's cross the road. Oncoming traffic, hey? I don't know. Tell me what you guys think of running towards oncoming traffic or riding your push bike towards oncoming traffic. Do you prefer it or will you go the opposite? All right, eagle nest. Here we are. Look at it. It's a beautiful place in the world. Two cars down here. Not bad. So good to watch the sunset here. Uh, woo. I don't know if you can see that you know a couple of years ago this used to never be here used to be able to walk down to the edge sit on the edge watch the sunset and um there you go they reckon uh you can see whales here when uh they're migrating but I've spotted them out from Cape Patterson but never down here, but anyway, it'll be nice to see it down here. Let's, uh, let's get down here and have a look. This is another look out here.
Here we go. Look out. What a beautiful view. Hey, look at that. I definitely I don't definitely don't recommend to go down here but I've done it a couple of times to watch the sunset but please don't go down there because uh, it's a cliff and uh, it's a hell of a way down but we could uh, let's get up on here oh. and get the better view Ugh. wow but like I said it's a cliff it's a cliff right there so please don't go down there and try and play around because it's a it's a hell of a way down and if you survive it you got a second chance in life but I'll tell you what them rocks down there would do some damage so stay on this side stay on this side of the uh, boundary uh, and um, I normally I launch off um, Inverloch and I normally fish out there um, you can't fish in here because this is all protected um, a national park or whatever but um, there's a there's a little orange or yellow um, sign right up on top of that um, uh, bloody cliff so from that side of the cliff you can fish and I think it goes about a K out that way and then back across and there's another sign somewhere there yeah but in this area you're not allowed to fish but, but we'll make a move anyway all right here we go this is the hill that i was climbing earlier now it's going to be nice going down it this was is true time has gone here it is, this rock goes on the chair Hope you see while they don't be scared Time has gone, so here it is I'm not your son, you're not my father We're just 